Enter the outpost. Some vein? Sacrifice that to Mila so she can get lit. I think that's it for us here. Uh, did I miss anything? I don't think so. The war room. <gasps> the lightning sword is the best thing ever, man. It's a, it deals a set 15 damage, I'm pretty sure. No, I'm certain about it. That was in the trailer. Let's see what else we got here. Got my arm x-ray or my arm scope vision over here. The old dungeon. Claire. Lucas, you came to rescue me. Why, how simply gallant of you. Now extricate me from this filthy and unseemly cage at once. <laughs> Somewhere in the distant Norway, uh, bald, loud Norwegian is screaming in happiness. Should we just take the key and leave? <laughs> Hard bread is in my sights. Table. No, I'm just not gonna do that. You there. The boy will offer a lady his hand. Who, me? Oh, uh, sorry. Very good. <sighs> I say, it does feel good to move about again. I thought I might never emerge from that disgusting pigsty. You have my thanks. Uh... This is Alm. He recently joined us in the Deliverance. Oh! Well, how simply lovely. Welcome! I am Claire. The young man may address me as Lady Claire or Milady. Um, uh, it's a pleasure to meet you, Milady. So, from where do you hail, Om? Uh, I hail <laughs> from a little place called Ram Village. A village? You don't say! That's one of those places with all the cows and the barns and the fields, yes? Um, yeah, something like that. My word! I hardly ever speak with villagers! What is it like to chase cows every day? I wager they bite the nasty creatures. Hmm... And yet you aren't smothered in manure. This is not what I pictured. Right. Um... Claire, perhaps you should consider Alm's feelings in regards to his home. His... Huh? Oh dear, have I done it again? It's as Clive constantly reminds me. The Deliverance is not like the Knights of Zofia. Not every soldier in our ranks is noble, but we must treat them all as equals. The peasant must forgive his lady for this gauche breach of etiquette. It's all right. The peasant, whose name is Alm, will get over it. <laughs> oh, Alm. The sass. I can see you are truly kind. Might I ask you more about your village later? I'm ever so curious. Where's Gray? Of course. That's all I'm asking. Splendid. I've always wanted to know more about cows and pigs and such. Yes, they're... They're amazing. <laughs> He's sweating. <laughs> He's like, the fuck is with this lady? Whew, 
she's going to be a handful. Yeah, I, uh, <clears throat> that's what I'm hoping. <laughs> huh. Hey, what are you scheming? What do you think, homie? What? Nothing. Uh-huh. Oh, that is too funny. Hey, lad. Thank you for freeing us. I thought my time had come. You're new to the Deliverance, right? Then you'll want to hear this. They say Mother Milla has disappeared from her temple. That's why Regal was able to break the Divine Accord, which was supposed to prevent them from ever invading Sophia. I don't know how much of it's true, but it's disturbing nonetheless. Thanks for the info, buddy. Greetings, Alm. Have you grown accustomed to all the fighting yet? Ah, oh, of course. Heck yeah! I suppose I needn't even have asked. No matter how quiet a village you hail from, in the hands of a capable teacher, one can become every bit as strong as a royal knight. I find that thought quite inspiring. I grew up in the borderlands as well, though not the same as yours. Some in the Deliverance ridicule me for this, calling me a backwater noble. But unlike them, I rose above my origins on my own merits. And as a result, here I stand today. You never can truly tell where life is going to take you all. I love Lucas, man. I love I love him. I love him as a character. It was my mother's idea for me to become a cleric. She was a cleric as well. As for my father, I fear I never met him. When I was little, my mother and I went on a long pilgrimage. So you see, I'm quite used to grueling marches such as this. I can look at the sky and read the weather. I know which plants are edible. So if you find yourself wanting for advice, simply say the word. Thanks, Theek. <laughs> Appreciate the gesture, Theek. Um, I guess we can keep going, man. I'm on a roll. I'm feeling it. This is the really fun thing about Gaiden in the original, was that you could just feel like you could just keep playing, because there was, like, the writing isn't so taxing to the point where you have to, like, l really sit down and take it. It's really good that there's a lot of voice acting in this game, in complement to the fact that there's a lot of battles in between. It's a very well-balanced medium of, of, narr of narration and, and combat, uh, which makes it really, really fun to play and really fun to, uh, you know, continuing on your playthrough. And that's one of the things, that's, that was one of the reasons why I really enjoyed Gaiden as well, was just that fact that you could just really settle, you could just chill and sort of do your own thing and just relax and play the game. Just, you could just play Gaiden, man. You could just play it. You could just play it. Actually, I want to see if we do this. Does, does, I want to see if Claire is like crazy about the village. The school in town that I went to was closed because of the war. At first, I was glad to leave that place, return to the village, and kick back. Then I remembered how little there is to learn inside a small village. I never hated learning, per se. I just hated all the other hellish parts of attending school. The other students would hound me from sun's rise to set. Just a bunch of lonely little children desperate for friends. What? Don't grin at me like that. I mean it. <laughs> First battle of Southern Sophia. Let's do it. Is this the crazy long? No, it's not. Yes, it is! <laughs> oh my god, I love how they kept this wonky ass map design. Alright, select units. We're all here, we're all accounted for. So you have four defense, eight res. Uh, attack plus two from the Iron Lance. So you have you're dealing ten attack. These two have six defense, uh, and they have ten. So you have four defense, uh, and you're quite fast. So you're going to be doubling them. Man, I really want Lucas to at least get another speed. I should have gave him at least one of those speed buffs things. Maybe he'll level up. Maybe he'll level speed here. Uh, eight, eight defense. These guys have 11, so that's three. Uh, we can attract three guys here. 
All right. Uh, okay. New map. There we go. Come at me, fools! Come at me, fools! Look at that formation. Oh, I forgot about the bolt sword. Whoops. I can I can pick it up in my convoy though, so that's good. Get some speed now. Yeah, these these guys are all just chilling out here. Now we mean business. <laughs> now we're talking. A set 15 damage. That's nonsense right there. I can tell. Stealing all the glory again. Hmm. Can Wrath Strike take this guy down? No. Yes. Seek. Skill and luck. That's good. Be a little bit careful here, bring you back out. Got a boy. So we can take down these two. Five defense. Take him out. Skill, speed, and luck. That's good. He has a lot of luck. 14 luck. I dig that. Uh, this guy has four speed. I'm not getting doubled. No, I can I can double him. That's good. Well, on this end, then, uh, she has four defense. These guys both have a 11 and 12. Oh, damn. And they're both in the range if I go there. So, But if I stick there... Here, let's trade. Let's trade. Let's trade this. You can keep with the lance there. Come on. Damn, I'm good. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I made a miscalculation there. I made a miscalculation there. That should do it. Hmm. What's this? Why are they doubling me? Oh wait, Nosferatu has weight to it. <sighs> Nosferatu has weight. It has two weight, which makes which mitigate. Wow, that was stupid. I really fucked up that one. Uh, and also probably this too. Fire has weight. I forgot how magic works. <laughs> Might have to make another survival test number two because I'm. I'm my guide and my guidance is a little bit rusty here. I'm just learning everything over again. Yeah, a, a weapon a, like weapon rate is something that people still don't like. People don't have a grasp of yet. I feel like this is a lot of stuff for like people who've come off 3ds would really have to remember. Like it, now, it's it's for me. It's just a matter of remembering how this game works again, um, to the fullest extent. Sure, why not? All right, let's see here. Yeah. 
I love how you can trade. Like... Trade. Boom! Look at these strats! Uh, 12 and 6, which is 6 damage. Uh, he's doubling me? I want to see how you fare. Not a lot. Yeah, this is Claire's issue is that she kind of was just awful. But she's using drinking water right now, so... All right, last one. I'll take my health pack, thanks. <laughs> Those 60s never give up. Those 60s never quit. Ah, oh, I I love Gaiden trade strats now. I love it. I love trade strats. You bore me. Be gone. All right, heals, please. All right, let's see what these guys have. Six speed, and I have uh, seven, which I, oh, damn, I will get doubled with the fire. Bummer. Can someone get to that? We'll just let them come at me. <laughs> Level up! Alright. Uh, it's a little bit more chips. Let me see if I can get some heals in though. Uh, 47 experience, 21. Let's see if I can sneak some heals here. How's that? How's that? Pretty good. It's more fun when we barely escape with our lives, right? Clive? Claire, you're safe. Oh! Fernand! Oh, good day, Fernand. And what brings you here? Need you even ask? When I heard you had been taken prisoner, I mounted my finest destrier and sped here at once. Sir Clive couldn't leave the hideout without its commander, of course. But I see I am a step behind regardless. Who is this rabble? Um, are you talking about us? They are not rabble, Fernand. This boy is Alm. He is the grandson of Sir Mycin himself. Mycin's grandson? Lucas, I demand to know the meaning of this. You were ordered to find the general himself, not some newly child. Sadly, Sir Mycin was not so easily convinced. However, Alm and his friends have joined our cause in his stead. Is this some manner of folly to you, Lucas? Am I to be amused? Such base-born curs cannot possibly aid our cause. The Deliverance has no place for brats with pitchforks. Fernand, you must listen to reason. This guy. These curs you so easily disparage fought valiantly for us. In fact, without Alm, we might not have retaken the southern outpost. I can vouch for their strength. <laughs> As if the word of a backwater noble carries weight with me. Your entire house should be kissing the Knights of Sophia's feet. Uh, I think that's Don't enough. take that! You can say whatever nasty things about me you like. 
I'll get over it. But Lucas deserves your respect. That's right. I beg your pardon? Do I look like a man who listens to the opinions of peasants? Then you can listen to me, because I happen to agree with him. Fernand, my brother already explained this to you, did he not? Sir Clive, what exactly did he explain? A soldier's worth is not determined by the station of his birth. If we do not all fight together as one, then we will never defeat Desay. Those are wise words. Unforgettable words. Desay's forces already have us at heel. Yet you would splinter us further? <sighs> you there, boy. <sighs> That's me, I take it? <laughs> Out of respect for Sir Clive, I will permit you to join the Deliverance. But you will learn your place. Now, Claire, seeing as you are safe, you have no need for these people. Come, let us return. We must report this matter to Sir Clive at once. I will do no such thing. I'm going with Om. Very well. Do as you please. All right, oh, Fernand. What a jerk! I've never met someone so rude. I guess we've been spoiled by Lucas. He nearly <laughs> convinced me that swinish knights are the exception, not the rule. But that was a swine, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Poor dears must be so upset. I apologize for the way he treated you. Don't be silly. You don't have to lower yourself for a miserable human being like that. Oh my. Oh great. Here we go. What? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> well, regardless, please don't think ill of Fernand. He wasn't always like this. The world changed him. Did something happen to him? <sighs> we live in trying times, and some things that transpire are difficult to put into words. In any case, we should be on our way. All right, man, uh, that's been 40 minutes, so I'm gonna cut it off here. If this is the end of a part, I'm not really sure if it is yet due to the timing here. Just wanna say thanks for watching. I'm so enjoying, oh, the characterization is so great in this game. We're setting up all these characters, everyone's relevant. It's like, it's mid, it's like, it's, yes, supports are very, very realistic, I suppose. But we can go back and like, uh, it's so fun to just go back and backtrack and see what else is new. Like there's so much going on in this game and I'm so happy for it. Oh, uh, beautiful. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you guys next time. Deuces.